Hello and thank you for calling the Autoglass Helpline. Today we are working on a 2016 Mercedes S550. So, um, these ones are kind of interesting because they've got a little bit different aspect to the camera shroud here. And they've got this little guy right here. You can see the brake along the bottom. This guy flips out. So like so doesn't actually come off. So don't try to yank that guy off of there. And then the rest of this kind of pulls down like normal. You can take your ever-present screwdriver and give that a little pry. And pop it off there. And before we pop the other side off, we want to remove this guy right here. And we're going to take our little WRD hook because it's got a nice little bend there. It gives us a good angle. And if you can see in there, there's a little groove on that edge. And we're going to push down on that to pop that guy loose, like so. So, what we're doing is we're looking for this little groove right here. So when you push down on this, you can see that guy flex. So, I'm just going to push down on that to release it on both sides. And then you can see it slips right out. Him down there. And we can pull the rest of this guy loose. Slip our mirror up and out of the way. And then slide this guy forward to get him to let go. So you can see you got your little loop here and then your little grabbers there that grab onto that little flap. So like so, that is that. We put him in the back so he doesn't get broken. And then your camera is pretty standard. You're going to push back and drop the front of it out. Let's remove our rain sensor first and get him out of the way. And these pull down from the back and they actually lock into there. So let that guy pop loose there. And then take our camera. And you can see what you can do here is actually go in here with your ever-present screwdriver and push back like so, and it'll actually pull down on this. Don't dive way down in there because you don't want to scratch or touch that lens. But it's just an easier way to get that camera to fall away. And we are going to go ahead and unplug this guy because it's a heavy one, and we don't want to bang into it with anything, so we'll set that in the back seat as well. And then unplug our defroster here. And we'll use our mirror, since we don't have to remove it, to hold our rain sensor and our other wires out of the way. So that is that. And you are all clear and ready to cut out. All right. Thanks for watching. Until next time.